is what's your favorite thing about summer? Warmth. Sundresses. Sundresses. <laughs> I think it's great. Oh God, I feel so bloated. This is what you see. I said, let's go try on dresses. They're not after brunch. And then, <laughs> I said, try on dresses, because this is not a guess. I had to have brunch. I can't start on a Sunday without it. So that's not true. You just choose not to start on a Sunday. <laughs> like, we could have got up early. We could have got here at 10. You do the whole sundress thing, and then eat. But we had to rush through brunch. I'm bloated. I'm glad I'm not trying to undress. You know how I feel about people watching me eat? I like to get there early. <laughs> that's, always, like, not, that's not cool. Like, at a restaurant, people first of all, they're not, it's a little narcissistic to think they're looking at you. <laughs> they're looking at their own food. They don't watching you. Are you looking at your food? They're looking at their own food. They're not watching you. How can I be sure of that if I'm looking at my food and eating? Does it matter? <laughs> Think about it. Does it matter? Well, it, it does, because then they see how, how garish my face looks when I eat. <laughs> but where did they calendars work Size smaller though, because that looks big on you. Is that cool? That's Melissa. Um. <laughs> I was saying lady to her. What is the term of it? That's nice. I have a name though. Melissa. Melissa. See, they don't call women broad anymore. I learned that on my calendar. It was originally a term for meat. <laughs> she has a word. I got her a word in it. I know. It's, it's fine. I'll just have it. No okay. And we're going for a size small. What size? What size? You'll just find out. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's on them. All right. All right. I was going to yell at a number, but she says, gotcha. She said, run. Yes. <laughs> um, I've been looking all through the boxes, and I can't find my hairbrush, you guys. Okay, that would be great if I, mean, I, were... I could just run my fingers. Okay, I was gonna say that would be great if I were missing the blow dryer. Uh -huh. I have the blow dryer. <laughs> <laughs> I need the brush. And I looked in all the boxes, all of the ones that labeled for my are labeled for my bedroom, and I can't find them. So did maybe I you do like a little mermaid thing with a fork or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> the issue is not trying to find alternative ways of brushing my hair. The, the issue is helping me find my brush. Although I do appreciate the suggestions, you guys. Thanks. Yeah, thank you. No problem, ma'am. Well, the, I mean, <laughs> I mean, being both detectives, let's go to the source of the crime.
gets a match with <laughs> chastity. Okay, Max. Uh huh. When she moved out, she just left it here, and it's a really nice brush. I didn't want to throw it away. I disinfected it. I thought I got all the hairs off. Maybe I didn't. But it's mine now. You guys really don't have anything better to do today? All right, we're going to take you in. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> Jen, I'm so glad you're here. Welcome home. <sighs> so good to see you. My God. You've been in Arizona for so many years. I know. At college. I know. <laughs> God. <laughs> Suspecting you. I didn't even know she was suspecting me. <laughs> <laughs> 
suspect. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just asking if you could maybe not make all those noises when you take a bite. It's a little garish. <gasps> uh. <laughs> Someone ordered the brunch ribs? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I deigned to. Oh, <laughs> the calendar. Oh my god, I thought you were too. What was your word of today? <laughs> Circumvent? <laughs> to go around. Now is a big. I have that one last week. Do you have the Webster's calendar? Oh my god, yeah. I learned about cold turkey. About why they call something cold turkey. Why do they call something cold turkey? Somebody made it up in the 17th century. Oh my god, I had no idea. Oh my god, yeah, that person. We our <laughs> <laughs>
did, uh, did, I thought her name was Jen. Was it Carrie? Carrie Jen. <laughs> I can't keep all your friends straight, babe. What? Did, did Carrie Jen, like, help you sort this situation out? <laughs> what we decide. <laughs>
<laughs> and how's a nice way and you can say that? <laughs> like, what's a nice way you can say to a lady there might be six dads? Right? I heard six a lot about different options. males were somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> I have really good I, mean, I want you to think about how this could have happened, and I want you to recreate it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's how we do every case, so I, I'm okay with that. Uh, yeah. You take three, and I'll take three, and um, maybe I'll be her. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that feels right. C Cassandra, right? Same <laughs> right. <laughs> time? Same time. Hey, Cassandra! It's Ben and Chill. What's up? Hey, Ben. Hey, Chill. <laughs> My friend went out for 
drinks with the teacher. So how's that not cheating? No, that's, that's really <laughs> messed up. This whole scenario is just really twisted. Girls, don't see yourselves like, you know, life is, life's hard, okay? I tell my little girl all the time. You do. Life's hard, okay? What's important is that you get the right abortion doctor. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry about that last one. <laughs> <laughs> What I've been with Is that so hard? You just tricked me into admitting I had a bad abortion doctor. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, your life is kind of like Grease. No, not Grease. Dirty dancing. <laughs> really messed up. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, because my dad, yeah, wasn't a doctor. Yeah. Your dad was a fair doctor. <laughs> Oh, I'm a roommate detective too. <laughs> 